Hey, what's up everybody? This is Kay Rail, Chief Fitness Advisor for Pine Pond Superfoods and Train for Longevity. Today I'm going to talk about the benefits of eating club training. These are eating clubs. These have been long, around longer than your great grandparents have been around. They've been around for probably 300 years plus. In America, they date back to the golden era of fitness, which was between 1880 and 1920, where they were used in YMCA's, gyms, military forces, and colleges across America. And if you look at any historical training pictures, you would see a bunch of eating clubs lined up against the wall all the way around every single gym that occurred back in the golden era of fitness. Why are these so beneficial? Well, here's one of the reasons why. Instead of being used in a linear fashion, which say a bicep curl does, that's fine and dandy, it works your biceps, it gives you guns, and it makes you look good on the beach. But these involve circles, spirals, and figure eights. When you do motions like this, it brings a lot of oxygenated rich blood flow to your joint capsules, making them stronger and more resistant to all the heavy beefcake training that you do out there, such as deadlifts, bench presses, shoulder presses, military presses, those kind of things. So for example, I'm just gonna step back and show you this. We bring them up like this, and then we bring them around. This is called an outward heart shape exercise right here. So what you're doing is you're making these circles and these spirals and these figure eights, these graceful, beautiful things. So what they do is they bring a lot of oxygenated, rich blood to your joints, making them stronger and more resistant to pain and trauma. They also help improve your recoveries after you do happen to have an injury with a shoulder or an elbow or a wrist. And speaking of all three of those areas, any clubs improve the range of motion in your wrist, your elbow, and your shoulder through the circular spirals and figure eights that you do when you're using Indian clubs. Another thing that they're really good for is posture. So I'm going to go from a side angle now, and I'm going to do that same heart shape. So we go like this, and what I'm ended up doing is making a circle, and then I'm pulling my shoulder blades back, and then extending my arms up like this. So what that does is it helps stretch your chest and your shoulders in the front, front delts, and also it strengthens these muscles right here called the rhomboids, which often become weak from sitting for long periods of time. So when you're sitting like this, typing on your computer all day, or if you're a truck driver, or you're in your car a lot, if you're some kind of salesman, that puts your, your upper body into a forward cross complex, which is bad posture. We don't want bad posture because it causes bad breathing habits, and it also causes your organs to be misaligned. When you start using eating clubs, and you start pulling your shoulder blades back like this, you improve your posture because you're strengthening your rhomboids, which will pull your shoulder blades back, and then it'll give you better posture through the course of time. So that's another big benefit of any clubs. Now, neurological load occurs when you do complex movement and you cross the midline of your body, which is right here. So cross body patterns fire up the brain cells more than any crossword puzzle you're ever gonna do or any kind of, I don't know what, complicated problem or like reading books and stuff like that. These things are crossing the midline of your body. So every time you do this, you're getting a cross body pattern, you're firing this up like a Christmas tree, and you're making yourself smarter and more intelligent, and we can always use that. Also, it helps improve your memory and your cognitive ability, and also, it is in my estimation that because you're doing all this firing of the brain, it's going to help prevent any kind of dementia or Alzheimer's or any kind of brain affected disease as you get older. So, all those benefits right there rolled into one make these tools absolutely fantastic. And not to mention, they're good for your grip as well, your grip strength. So, Dead arm hangs like this work really good for your grip or weighted carries if you're using kettlebells and stuff. But Indian clubs, when you start doing wrist circles like this kind of stuff and get fancy like this and do hip reels and those kind of things. So anytime you're doing a wrist circle like this, inward or outward, it really strengthens your wrist and your grip and your forearm strength too. So you've got that benefit to look forward to with Indian clubs as well. Lastly, if you're doing beefcake workouts and you're doing like bench presses or deadlifts or military presses or whatever, after your set is over, pick these Indian clubs up and do a quick set of outward heart shapes or parallel heart shapes like this in between your sets. By doing that, you're flushing the lactic acid on your muscles just like that, quick as can be. So that's one more benefit. And when you do that, it's gonna help you rec recover faster in between your sets, enabling you to lift more weight and to lift with more proficiency with better form and technique. So, do you think that's a good sales pitch for these? I think so. If you want any more information on eating clubs or how to use them, hit me up. This is K-Rep. I'm the Chief Fitness Advisor for Pine Pond Superfoods and Train for Longevity. Make sure to like and share our videos and please subscribe to our page. Till next time.